Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kira and I was thinking and praying this morning and this is something that hit me personally and I was like I just have to share it because it's so good. Um, but this is Galatians 6 verses 4 through 5 and I know I talk about this these two verses a lot because I absolutely love them and it says this make a careful exploration of who you are and the work you have been given and then sink yourself into that do not be impressed with yourself do not compare yourself with others each of you must take responsibility for doing the creative best you can with your own life and I love this because first of all we're sinking ourselves into what God has called us to be and who we are in the pairing and the merging of that. We're not sinking ourselves into other things, uh, whether it be work or school or what have you. I mean, those can be things that God has called us to, but what has God laid on your heart to do? And not that work, school, whatever is bad, but is that what you're called to do or is that a way of continuing your education, making money, what have you, but that you take a careful look at who you are, who God has called you to be, and then the work you have been given to do. So what has God called you to do? Who are you and who has God called you to be? And what has he called you to do? And the pairing of that, and then sink yourself into that, not just half-heartedly, not when you feel like it, but fully invested into what he has called you to do and who you are. And I love this because God gives us a calling, but he also recognizes that each of us are individuals made in his image and completely different. And so with that, he understands that he can call us to something and how we live that out in our relationship with God is gonna look totally different than my friend or even my best friend or my husband because I am unique, I'm one of a kind and so are you. And so as you live out what God has given you to do, it's going to look completely different and is not even worthy of comparison because we are each made in the image of God, but we're all different and that's unique and there's something so special in that and powerful in that. And so I just pray this is an encouragement to you as you go throughout your week that you can take time to really sit down and be like, Holy Spirit, like show me who I am and God, show me the work you've given me to do. And then just throw yourself into that, sink yourself into that. I love it. Paul says that sink yourself into that, that you're not just half-heartedly going into it, but you're fully invested in working this out. And friend, I just want to encourage you that this is the God that we serve, that he loves us so much, that he wants to partner alongside of us and bring his plan through us, but also recognizing that we are individuals and that he made us completely unique and different on purpose and there's such beauty in that so i pray this is an encouragement to you this week to just walk out fully invested sinking yourself into what god has given you to do and who he has called you to be i hope you have an amazing week please if you have any prayer requests leave them in the comments down below any questions you would like answered and i will see you all next week have a fabulous week everyone